journey of a thousand miles is to begin, it must begin with that first step. I have miles to go before I sleep. This is Electrify Mojo. I have prepared my ship for takeoff. And now we are ready for hyperspace. Commence hyperspace. The great prophet once said, love knows not its own depth under the hour of separation. I leave you with the sadness now, as my ship has just exited Earth's atmosphere. But know that one day I shall return to you as you try to perfect your society. Absolutely perfect your relationship with your children. Give not all to your children. They will get a false impression of life. They will feel that all of their desires of the world will come knocking at their door without sacrifice. Invest in their future with your own time. It's the most you or anyone could ever give. Teach them to join the procession of those who work. In doing this, you truly teach them how to live. Teach them how to fly when the nest is nearby. If they should fall, they will land on your wings. Make sure they know that these are life's special moments. Moments to learn. Moments to smile. Moments that love brings. Absolutely the last page from a book called The Mental Machine. Absolutely. traditions 
of the homeland in mind, in body, and in spirit. They were Africans in America, culturally, ethnically, biologically, Africans, geographically, Americans, their descendants would become Americans, culturally, Americans, ancestrally, biologically, to a great percentage, many would remain Africans. An American African, another page from a book called The Mental Machine, Biological Derivatives from an African Shore. Behind the mist of time, come let your mind soar. Captives from African nations, the great slave ships bore. Men, women, boys, and girls ripped from the soul of Africa's interior. The slave ships barren Africans throughout the Americas docked, dropping human cargo from the South Atlantic up to Plymouth Rock. Africans come into America with their customs and languages mentally locked would then give birth to the American Euro-African paradox. Some 400 years later, the years of cultural deprivation have taken their toll from the slave yards to the graveyards to the California sands, from the cotton fields to the killing fields, from the factories to the streets, up here stranded in the north, south, east, and west are millions of American Africans. An American African, another page from a book called The Mental Machine. I don't know. Another page from a book called The Mental Machine. The next time you find yourself in a quagmire, for whatever reason, maybe you got fired, maybe you didn't get the promotion, maybe you had a car accident, maybe you got bad news on the telephone, maybe you got turned down for a new car loan or a house. The worst thing you can do is sit there and succumb to pressure. I don't know another page from the mental machine. I don't know what I'm going to do now, but I know that I'm not going to just sit here. I don't know what I'm going to discover by getting out, but I do know that only gridlock comes from fear. I don't know what the future holds for me, but I will meet each new challenge with courage every day. I'm not going to go down without a fight. No, not without a fight. Rumors of my doom are hearsay. It's true. There is no sunshine in my world today. I guess it's just my week for the rain to fall. But to the seeds buried beneath the earth, a raindrop is love and a promise of the sun. Mother Nature's wake-up call. I don't know. Another page from a book called The Mental Machine. You probably heard the expression, dreams of the wings of the mind. I found that it's not just an expression. It's actually true. Because unless you are able to dream, it's impossible for the man to fly. It's impossible for the man to stay alive unless you dream. Without a dream, you're just an empty shell waiting to be cracked. A mushroom waiting to be crushed. A puddle of water on a hot day waiting to evaporate. Without a dream, don't expect to be here long. 
you want to live, if you want to stay alive, if you want to prosper, not just survive, you must dream great dreams. Dreams are the wings of the mind, and it's flight time. Will you just dream today? Another page from a book called The Mental Machine. The great ones who got us dreaming may not be the victors at all. The victors are the people who just believed and dreamed. The small who then stood tall. The great ones who dared us to dream, though gone, are not far away. They just look down from the sky and cry and ask, will you just dream today? We must become our brother's keeper just to keep our dreams alive. We must dream of a world without stupid people. Ignorance must not survive. We must dream of a world without guns and war. The tools of fools must go. We must recreate our schools and universities, not sales, jails, and death row. The great ones who got us dreaming are not that far away. They just look down from the sky and cry and beg. Will you just dream today? Will you just dream today? Another page from a book called The Mental Machine. To the nations of the world, on the night sky, the great canvas of time, with words, music, and moods, I paint. Wisdom, beauty, and truth need never to experience restraint. Our actions must not represent the darkness of the past. They must fulfill the demands of the present the hopes of the future and the dreams of mankind. We must not seek to be only awesome in spirit. We must recapture the glow of angels. We present the final page of the mental machine. Your Majesty. Your Majesty walks among you, my beloved a giver and a receiver of your truth. As God gives to us, we must give back to each other. The wizened elders must return the truth to the youth. Let my life be as a lyric to a song, my beloved, an evocation of right in a world full of wrong, an act of engagement not Custer's last stand. And to the silent beloved, little girl be a woman, little boy be a man. My day is ending and God has blessed me. I must get ready to move with the tide. Though the waves have been rough and bumpy, adversity has taught me, my beloved, to thank God for the ride. Your majesty leaves you now. He is headed back out to sea. Though he shall never forget that it was reciprocal truth. The words we shared were words that made us free. Your majesty, the final page from a book called The Mental Machine. There are two races on the face of the earth, the human race and the rat race. Which one are you in? If you take the front cover of the mental machine box and point it toward the sun, you will see a rainbow and steady war no more. Jstone Audiobooks has presented the mental machine. <laughs>